In this video, we'll be looking at another physics question on the parallel combination of resistors. Okay. The question here says five parallel resistors, each with a resistance of 20 ohms, are connected in parallel to three parallel resistors, each having a value of 15 ohms. What is the total resistance? Okay. So you can be asked for total resistance or equivalent resistance. They mean the same thing. So how do we solve this question? Now to solve this question here, solution. Now to solve this question, if you look at this, this is part four. Recall that in the part three, we said that whenever you have a number of resistors of the same value combined in parallel, their total resistance one over R is given by N times one over R. All right, let me call this R T. The total resistance is equal to N times one over R where n is the number of resistors and r is simply the value of the resistors. If you look at this question here, the first n we have here is 5. We said 5 parallel resistors and of course it said have a resistance value of 20 ohms. All right? So for this, we would have that the total resistance 1 all over r total is equal to 5 resistors, so 5 times 1 all over, each with um, a resistance value of 20. So this is this. This particular expression here gives us the value for the first 5, right? They said it is also connected in parallel, right? So all I have to do is find this one first. Since it's in parallel, it becomes plus. So I'll put this one in the bracket there. Plus. So plus. Open a bracket. Let's get the next one there. For the next set, you can see that we said they have three parallel resistors, all right? Each of them having a value of 15 ohms. So that becomes the number of resistors N is now three. That becomes three. That's N times one all over. The resistance value is 15 ohms. So it becomes three times one all over 15. All right, let's solve this question and get an answer. This becomes 1 all over R total, it's equal to, of course, 5 times 1 over 20 gives you 5 all over 20, plus, next up you have 3 times 1 over 15, that gives you 3 times 1 is 3 all over 15. Let's proceed with this. From here I have 1 all over R total, it's equal to, Reducing this to the lowest term, 5 here, 1, 5 here, 4. I have 1 all over 4 plus 3 here, 1, 3 here, 5. 1 all over 5. All right, let's solve this. For this, I have 1 all over R total. It's equal to my LCM of 4 and 5. It's simply 20. So if I take my LCM, is 20. 20 divided by 4 is um, 5. Use the 5 to multiply 1. 5 times 1 is 5. So I have my numerator there as 5. Bring down the sign here, plus. So I have plus. Next up, 20 divided by 5 gives you 4. 4 times the numerator there, 4 times 1 gives you 4. So it becomes this plus 4. Let's work with this. This becomes 1 all over R total. It's equal to 5 plus 4 gives you 9 all over 20. All right. To get the value of R total, all I have to do is take this one up and bring this down. All right. So I have R total all over 1. It's equal to take this up, bring this down. That becomes 20 all over 9. So from this, I have R total. Of course, R total over 1 gives you R total. It's equal to, so I'll simply get my calculator and punch 20 divided by 9. And if I do that, what's my answer? So 20 divided by 9, that gives you about 2.22 approximately in ohms. So this becomes the answer to this question. So here's how you solve this question, all right? Okay, guys, so let me give you your own task. Um, same question. We'll change this from 5, uh, change this from 5, 
let's say we had this as six instead all right six resistors of uh let's say this is not 20 mm, let's use um 80 all right six resistors of 80 ohms are connected in parallel to three we we'll still maintain three resistors each having a value of 45 let's change from 15 to 45 ohms what is the total resistance so your question here is simple six parallel resistors each with a resistance of 80 ohms are connected in parallel to three parallel resistors each having a value of 45 ohm what is the total resistance so you have this right so you solve this question leave your answer in the comment section and i'll tell you if you're correct or not all right all right guys so don't forget that you can check out my available courses on my website simply visit www.jonahimano.com forward slash courses or you can look at the available books at www.jonahimano.com forward slash books all right do well to register an account to the website and then proceed to get any of the available courses or books you can also join my channel membership to get access to exclusive classes for just channel members all right i'll leave a link to my website as well as to join my channel membership in the video description also i'll leave a link to our whatsapp channel all right so join and then you get updated on our whatsapp channel all right all right guys so as usual if you enjoyed this video please do want to hit the like button all right hit the like button like this video leave a comment i give you a task solve the question leave your answer in the comment section and i'll tell you if you're correct or not do well to also subscribe if it is your first time here or you're yet to subscribe please do well to subscribe to this channel hit the bell icon and select all so that you get notified whenever we upload new content then finally share this video to your friends and colleagues so that they can also learn thank you and see you in our next class